As you step into the realm of esoteric exploration, brace yourself for a journey as captivating as the most enigmatic chapters of history. Picture it unfolding like the riddle of the fall of man, from spirit to matter, and as intricately woven as the fairy fabric of the enigmatic Taurus universe. Some interpretations suggest that the toroidal universe, with its continuous cycle of creation and destruction, mirrors the spiritual journey of humanity. The fall of man from grace, symbolized by the consumption of the apple in Eden, and this interpretation is seen as the descent of consciousness into materiality, trapped in the repetitive cycles of birth and death within this toroidal existence. Thus, in this interpretation, the apple becomes a metaphor for the moment when human consciousness became entangled in the physical realm, disconnected from its divine origin. Now let's delve deeper into the symbolism of the apple. Its shape, reminiscent of a Taurus universe, conceals profound meanings. The Taurus, like the apple, serves as a symbol of the transition from spirit to matter, where the unmanifested takes form. Metaphysically, the Taurus embodies the cyclical nature of existence, representing the continuous flow of energy between the spiritual and material realms, just as the Taurus loops back upon itself, symbolizing eternal recurrence. It reflects the perpetual journey of consciousness oscillating between the unmanifested and manifested states. Physically, the Taurus structure is ubiquitous in nature, from galaxies to atoms reflecting its fundamental role in shaping the universe. Its dynamic form suggests a constant exchange and transformation of energy, mirroring the process by which spirit infuses matter with life and consciousness, animating the physical world. The act of biting into the apple becomes a potent metaphor for the creation of the material world from the spiritual realm. It symbolizes the moment when the ethereal essence of the universe solidifies into the tangible, giving rise to the duality that shapes our perception. The story of Adam and Eve in the Garden of Eden further exemplifies this duality. Adam embodying the masculine energy, and Eve representing the feminine mirror the red and blue energies found in the symbolism of the apple. Interestingly, this duality resonates in various aspects of our lives, from the divisions in our political systems marked by red and blue, to the choice between a red or blue pill and the iconic cinematic allegory of the Matrix. The Matrix itself stands as a modern parable of our existence, a narrative that challenges our understanding of reality. It raises the provocative possibility that we are ensnared in a false material world, our minds entangled in an intricate illusion. It serves as an enthralling parable that transcends mere cinema, resonating deeply with the core of our quest for enlightenment. Its narrative mirrors the intricate labyrinth of thoughts and imagination we navigate in our relentless exploration of consciousness, and Neo's journey as he challenges the deceptive material world we find a reflection of our own odyssey. A call to pierce the illusion of separateness and embrace our profound interconnectedness with the cosmos. Within the matrix, the red pill emerges as a symbol of truth and awakening, aligning with our pursuit of knowledge in the realms of quantum consciousness and spiritual wisdom. It embodies the choice to embrace our dual role as both seekers and sources of enlightenment, echoing the ancient symbolism of the apple and the Taurus universe. The Oracle, a mystical guide in the film, mirrors the spiritual mentors who illuminate our path as we endeavor to decode the cosmic riddle. And as we delve deeper into the cosmic dance between spirit and matter, we awaken to the realization that the world we perceive is an intricately fabricated illusion. Much like Neo's discovery that humanity is ensnared in a simulated reality, we contemplate our existence as souls temporarily inhabiting human vessels. The red and blue pills epitomize the power of choice, free will, either awakening to the truth or remaining in the slumber of illusion. 
The Matrix beautifully echoes our own journey of self-discovery, inviting us to embrace our true essence as souls having a human experience. In this grand narrative, it converges seamlessly with our exploration of quantum consciousness and the interconnectedness of all things, weaving together threads of truth that beckon us to awake, evolve, and transcend the boundaries of the ordinary into the extraordinary. As we unravel these profound connections and contemplate the captivating concept of our false matrix, we are reminded that these colors aren't arbitrary. They represent fundamental energies that shape our reality. In this context, red and blue are not merely colors but symbols of fundamental energies, or polarities, that influence our understanding of the world. Red may represent aspects like passion, action, or materialism, while blue may symbolize qualities such as introspection, spirituality, or transcendence. These colors serve as visual cues to convey the duality and interplay of these energies in our lives. Ancient royalty, with their deep understanding of esoteric knowledge, recognized the hidden wisdom encoded within these colors. Red symbolizing passion and action was a hue associated with the vitality and vigor of life. It represented the fiery spirit that drives human endeavors and the pursuit of desires. The ancients knew that the energy of red, when harnessed wisely, could fuel great feats and achievements. Blue, on the other hand, was seen as a color of introspection and spiritual depth. It represented the calm waters of contemplation and the boundless expanses of the inner world. Ancient sages understood that blue held the key of inner peace and enlightenment, offering a path to transcend the limitations of the material realm. And then there's purple, a regal blend of red and blue, signifying the harmonious integration of earthly and spiritual energies. The wisdom of ancient royalty lay in recognizing that true power emerged from the balanced union of these fundamental forces. Purple was a symbol of divine authority, a reminder that mastery over one's own desires and spiritual growth were the hallmarks of enlightened leadership. When we speak of energies and dualities, it does raise intriguing questions. Where do these energies originate? And how do they shape the grand tapestry of our lives? As we unravel this enigma, we inevitably approach the heart of consciousness itself. Could it be that our thoughts, emotions, and intentions are mere manifestations of a deeper universal consciousness? Is there a hidden wellspring from which all these energies flow, converging and diverging like rivers in the landscape of the mind? Let's venture further into the mysteries of consciousness, the source from which these energies derive their essence. In our continued exploration, let's remember that these energies are not isolated fragments but integral threads woven into the fabric of reality. They form the very essence of our interconnection, guiding us on a journey to comprehend deep interplay between the individual and the cosmic, and to fathom the boundless depths of consciousness itself. Diverse theories, from materialism to panpsychism, form a rich tapestry of thought and inquiry. Amid this intellectual tapestry, the concept of quantum consciousness emerges as a showstopper, connecting the intricacies of the human mind with the vast cosmos. Quantum physics studying the tiniest particles reveals the idea of entanglement, where particles remain connected regardless of distance, defying conventional space and time. Applying this to consciousness, some propose our personal consciousness is linked to a universal one. Challenging the notion of isolated minds and suggesting our thoughts influence reality at a fundamental level this blurs the lines between self and cosmos, implying that our thoughts can shape reality on a minute scale, echoing a connection between our minds and the universe. In essence, our minds become mirrors reflecting a cosmic mirror, suggesting our thoughts can reach and influence the entire universe. Imagine two realms converging, one the realm of quantum physics delving into the universe's microscopic building blocks, the other, spirituality, exploring the profound and unseen. These two realms meet at a crossroads of discovery, unveiling a reality that aligns with age-old teachings. Scientists exploring the tiniest particles perceive patterns and connections resonating with ancient wisdom, 
deciphering a celestial code bridging seemingly distinct worlds. We often perceive the world through a material lens, seeking empirical evidence and scientific validation. Yet in the shadows there exists an uncharted, ethereal realm, one that eludes the confines of empirical understanding, untouched by the prevailing narratives of a conformist world. Let the light of consciousness pierce the shadows, awaken humanity. In elevating our consciousness, we become beacons of unity in a world often divided by shadows of separation. Just as darkness cannot exist in the presence of light, let us shine brightly and dissolve the veils that obscure our shared humanity. In the labyrinthine journey of life, seek the key to the cosmic riddle. As you explore the dance between spirit and matter, you are the author of your life's story, the director of your own epic, and the artist painting the masterpiece of your own journey. Both the weaver and the woven, the question and the answer, and within your very being lies the essence of existence. Human Fluence, out.